Hello, my name is Harry Rees and this is a portfolio of professional practice from a placement year at Thrifty Van and Car Rental where I worked as a data analyst. Thrifty prides itself as an organisation that's able to adapt to the ever-changing economic environment. This was central to its survival throughout the financial crisis of 2008. I have been examining to what extent I was able to develop dynamic capabilities within the organisation and how they contributed to organisational intelligence. To do this, I interviewed my colleagues and asked them how they felt my reports had influenced the business processes. Bill Flitcroft, Fleet Analytics Manager. As a result of Harry's reports, there have been significant changes to the way rebates are managed and pricing decisions are made. I was responsible for analysing which company would be the optimum supplier of windscreens and tyres by creating dynamic models for replicating their rebate structure. Simon Taylor, Vehicle Purchasing Manager. Harry has revolutionised the way that we purchase large quantities of vehicles. This report saves us many man hours and is significantly more accurate than previous methods. I built a report that created significant changes within the vehicle purchasing department. This report was largely automated and saved a great deal of time. It also allowed us to send order sheets that look considerably more professional than methods previously used. Martin Barth, Pricing Manager. After speaking to the other managers, then you, they mentioned that you brought significant change to many data streams, which has allowed for much clearer decision making. Specifically, I analysed the refurbishment cost of vehicles assess whether there were excess costs associated with a particular vehicle model. I also assisted the distribution department in calculating logistics costs and assessing whether there was a need for a full system upgrade. An example of some of my work is the vehicle purchasing report as mentioned previously. The report took vehicle utilisation statistics and assessed how many vehicles is the optimum number in any particular rental location. For each location, we needed to pick the nearest car dealer to pick the vehicles from. The report then created the order documents and attached them to emails. This report was a challenge to build because it required a degree of human intervention. Throughout my placement, my skills developed so that I was able to automate the majority of the process. My colleagues were initially sceptical of the report because it seemed so complicated. However, by the time I'd finished my placement, they opened to the idea of using it significantly changed the purchasing process. As you can see, the order sheet is very easy to read and understand. It indicates the derivative of vehicle required, T and colour of the vehicle, and finally, it indicates at what location we would like the vehicle to be delivered. The key factors that influenced my ability to instigate change were my technical skills. I realised this early on in my placement and made an effort to learn as many new skills as I possibly could. I self-taught myself to code in Microsoft VBA. This allowed for increased spreadsheet functionality and cross-application interactions. I also taught myself to code in Microsoft SQL Server. This allowed me to extract data and manipulate it before it went into spreadsheets. I taught myself to use Microsoft Power Pivot. This allowed me to create dynamic data models, which gave me significantly improved spreadsheet functionality It's safe to say that self-directed learning was central in my ability to instigate change. Another example of some work that brought significant change to a department was the reservations report that I made for the pricing department. As you can see, before I arrived at Thrifty, the pricing department used a static report which had gave very little indication of what action should be taken. On the right hand side, you can see the report that I created. I developed a colour scale that indicated what action could be taken. Commercial awareness was another factor 
that I felt made a significant difference in my ability to instigate change throughout my placement. I learned my commercial awareness by communicating with my colleagues and understanding their role. This helped me to form an understanding of the business model of Thrifty as a whole. As I developed commercial awareness, it allowed me to be more forthcoming with my ideas and drive change as an individual. By the end of my placement, I was able to approach problems holistically and present information in the way that was far more useful to managers. Michelle Flickcroft, Data Analytics Manager. Commercial awareness improved on each and every task you completed, which in turn helped with the next task. Throughout my time at Thrifty, they had the most profitable year on record. Martin Barth, Pricing Manager. Harry's commercial awareness has improved significantly throughout his placement. He was able to, be, to quickly quantify whether the numbers that were being produced made business sense. He presented numbers in a way that made decision making far smoother. During my placement, I was assigned the role of mentor. The directors decided to hire another analyst and I was in charge of training him in the IT systems and the use of the reports that I had created. Also, when my successor arrived from Lancaster University, I was also central to his induction. Through these two individuals, I was able to vicariously instigate change. Thank you very much for watching.